my friends dk here uh, today i am going to show you how to root your lg optimus flat p970 my current android version is 4.0.4 last night i watched lot of videos and i did the same thing but they are showing one video but it didn't work for me so i did spend some uh, i spent lot uh, some time on uh, internet and finally i got it so what we are going to do we are going to install these two softwares and we are going to update them both so this LG uh, mobile support tool is just a software to check that you have latest USB drivers uh, for your LG phone and another this thing is I tried with this normal software it didn't work for me so I what I did I updated this software and after that it worked for me I don't know it was the LG support tool or it was the updated version of this software but it worked for me so what I am going to do uh, I am going to tell you the same procedure so sir uh, just go to this website to download this uh, uh, software LG support tool uh, I am going to show you on uh, Chrome how you are going to do copy this setting uh, and uh, just uh, copy this URL and paste it in Chrome and this is the website so just go to mobile phones <coughs> Uh, check on uh, click on smartphones and select your uh, mobile phone LG P97 see LG P97 so go down 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 and here it is click on it after that you can see LG Optimus Black just click on go in here you go so click on this software update and driver here you are seeing these two so download this USB driver for Windows and also download this LG mobile support tool and this will be uh, of, uh, around 150 MB and this will be around uh, 30 MB I don't know exactly just install it after installing it uh, after installing this software uh, you will see uh, do not uh, forget to uh, do this thing uh, select PC connection type LG software when you connect your data cable with your laptop you will see three four options select fourth one LG software so that it can get connected to this uh, LG mobile support tool so I am going to show you uh, what will happen I am uh, now going to connect my mobile with this LG mobile support tool you can hear the sound so it now detecting my mobile after that you will see that uh, my uh, mobile uh, model number will be here and it is checking that I have uh, latest drivers on my PC uh, you can see your device has the latest software available from the LG mobile support tool so right now I am sure that I have latest LG drivers everything is latest so there will be no issue of connectivity second thing what we are going to do we are going to download this software click this uh, just copy this URL paste in uh, Chrome and uh, download this it is hardly a 33 MB software so download this software after downloading this install it it will look like this so this thing will not be there on your software just check for update download latest update it will take 5 to 10 minutes and after update it will uh, restart the software and restart unlockroot.com and after that just make sure that you have checked this thing go to settings then developer option if you click on this thing there will be some warning click ok then check on USB debugging do not forget to this thing and if possible do remove your sim cards and SD card and after doing that you are all set to do it you have just make sure that you have up to date on logroot.com so my phone is connected I already show you in LG mobile tool it is connected and now we are going to root so I am not going to root my mobile but I am going to show you up to uh, two three steps because I have already rooted my phone a few days back so just click on root before that what actually was happening it was showing only kill adb server but after doing this 
it's going smoothly so i am going to root starting a db server main it's going to work going online device main it will detect my device now you will see option of lg optimus 4.0.4 .4. after that you can proceed further it took me around 10 to 20 minutes but i am sure that it won't take that much time for you people <coughs> uh, get online devices so after getting that option click on that option and after doing that uh, this whole process you will see that it will ask you to install super user that is su in your device so click on yes and after that you will get your uh, mobile rooted successfully <coughs> i don't know why it's not working actually i'm getting lots of messages on my whatsapp so i have just disconnected my internet on my mobile but i'm sure that it, uh, you will get this thing just wait for more uh, some more time and you can do it uh, by removing you can see processor on cursor when I move this actually this video is going longer <coughs> okay after that uh, just uh, it will show you option like uh, select LG LG mobile 4.0.4 .4. and after after that you can click and proceed further so right now I'm going to my device uh, if you like my video and my tutorial just like and do not forget to subscribe thank you for watching